cancer. It's a very scary word. But an outstanding treatment facility was here at home. I was led to the Lawson Cancer Center. As a nurse practitioner at the Lawson Cancer Center, we are champions for our patients. I am so happy for Robert. The treatment worked. Make it On Monday, May 1st, Pikeville Medical Center paid a visit to Bevins Elementary for Doctor's Day. Several PMC representatives spoke to a kindergarten class about the different types of jobs in the medical field available in our region. Each of the children were thrilled to receive a gift bag and participate in hospital-themed activities. Yeah, this started because of uh, one of the teachers here at, at Bevins Elementary and reached out to us and they wanted us to see if we could help with a program that this kindergarten teacher had uh, on um, Doctor's Day. So we with the Workforce Development Center at Pikeville Medical Center thought this was a great opportunity for us to get into the schools and to talk to these kindergartners about what doctors and nurses do within the hospital. One of the things that we're doing as far as the initiatives that we have going is that we're working with the, the elementary schools, the high schools, and even in the colleges for uh, education trying to get these students to become aware of opportunities that we have right here in Eastern Kentucky for in our region so that students can consider a career in healthcare. Since the Doctor's Day program began in March 2023, over 600 elementary and high school students have been a part of it. The goal now is to expand the program over the following year to reach more students. I, uh, I'm really excited to have the opportunity uh, as a physician to come here at Bevins and talk to uh, the next generation of kiddos uh, about the importance of medicine and also the importance of their health. This is the reason I went into pediatrics is to be able to work with the next generation of kiddos. Truly, if we can ensure their health and their happiness, we can ensure a better course uh, a better future for the earth, right? Um, if the next generation is dedicated to happiness and health, then certainly uh, we're gonna leave the world a better place than where we found it. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Nick Collum.